Yo, what is up, guys? It's your bo I'm just kidding. I don't do that. I honestly, I wanted to do that for a lot longer than I did, but I just could not. I could not keep keep the charade going. I actually need to turn the music off because in the last episode, I edited that video, and I realized that uh, it sounds really crappy when the music is cut off by the jump cuts. So I'm just gonna do the video editing, music editing equivalent of superimposing. So we're going to do a command here, max stack all 64, so that I can stack food. Uh, and it's kind of cheaty, I know, but I just want to conserve inventory space. So, dang, I really need to turn this up. Hold on. So, uh, in the last episode, in the last episode, we went out... We did three things. We started a mine shaft over there. Uh, we found that dungeon, and then we went to a sand castle pyramid thingamajig way over there. Uh, and about halfway through that process, my computer ran out of hard drive space, and Shadowplay stopped recording. And I did not notice that that happened. Though I could have probably ended up catching it if I had paid attention to the message where my computer told me that my hard drive was running out of space. And there's more emails. Thanks, Windows. Appreciate it. So in this episode, I think our goal in mind is to kind of stick around here for a bit. Maybe add like a second story to the house for a bedroom. And explore underground in the cave that's attached to the dungeon. Because it might be pretty interesting. Um, okay. I'm going to need to, uh, y'all going to have to give me a moment. <laughs> I need to uh, mute telegram notifications again. Uh, and then we'll stack our food together. We don't need cookies. We don't need this or this. We don't need gold, wheat. We have a lot of wheat. If, there were, if this was a version of the game with farming, we'd be set. Don't need eggs, though it would be nice to be able to start a chicken farm or something. What was I going to say? I have no idea what I was thinking about saying there, but clearly it's departed from my mental whatever. So I think this is good. We should probably put the diamonds away too, just so we don't lose them. Uh, actually, we have enough diamonds to make a sword now. So we should probably... We might want to do that, actually. Let's go take a look inside this cave. Hopefully there's no spiders in here. I know that you can do that thing where, like, you neutralize the spawner or whatever it's called by putting torches all over the place but I don't know if that actually works looks pretty good from here I'm gonna take these chests so here's our cave oh oh, oh dear don't tell me this is another crappy cave at least it has like iron and shit in it unlike the other one okay this is this is just this this is outrageous. I'm going to sue Minecraft because for not making the caves bigger in these versions. Honestly, I like this cave generation more than what you find in the newer versions of the game because it's like feeling f feeling finding a cave in this version of Minecraft feels special, right? Like a, a really big monumentous cave it feels special um but i don't get that feeling with the newer versions of the game just because there's caves all over the place uh, you know the newer versions of the game in my opinion are pretty um they're just too it feels bloated honestly it all feels bloated you know i like my minecraft kind of simple and I get that that might be kind of an unpopular opinion. That's so it's okay if you disagree with me. I don't hate you for it. And I don't think any less of you for it. It's okay to be stupid. But the thing is, you know, Minecraft like this version of Minecraft has a very a very picturesque world generation. It has some of the best mods. Um well, actually I'll concede that point. Maybe the mods for this version are a little bit more odd versus the best mods, but I don't know. I like it. It's it's just what can I say? I like this version of the game. 
Uh, so it is turning nighttime here. Before, before we set the spawn point, let's not waste all our wood on ladders, but let's make a bunch of ladders here. And we're going to go and make a second story to the house. Wait a second. Uh. Yeah, I didn't think that one through, did I? With the whole glass ceiling thing. Huh. Um... Yeah, I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure how to fix that. Maybe we'll just maybe, let's just let's keep it one story for now, and we'll figure that out eventually. But there we go. Our spawn is now set, so we can die to our liking. There's a lot. Of, why is there so many pigs around here? God, I just love that view so much. Just like the cloud going through the mountain. Okay, so that was a big fucking failure. Didn't <laughs> didn't find anything in there. I don't know where to go from here. I uh it's shit. I don't know what to do. Uh, what's over here? What's this? Let, let's take a look at this thing. Nope, that doesn't go anywhere either. It does have coal in it though. I'm going to grab that coal. Hey, and it has iron. Look at that. Isn't that nice? I mean, that was like, that was my only idea as to what I could do this episode. I'm kind of at a loss. I do have a few other mods that I planned on installing to this version of the game. I want to get the Seasons mod, the Flan, Flans, is it Flan? The one that adds like airplanes and guns and stuff. And what was the other one? Battle Towers, because that'll provide some interesting objectives for the series. Uh, I guess we'll just kind of go for a walk. Here, here's something we could do. Uh, I have a, a mod called More Creeps and Weirdos, and it has two things that make for some pretty interesting gameplay. Uh, it has guinea pigs. It's not a joke. It has guinea pigs uh, that you can train to fight for you, with you, whatever you please. Um, and so that's pretty cool. I guess we haven't really gotten to appreciate the mountains over here either, so. I hope you're not running any mods in this game. Oh, here's a lawyer. Uh, you're not allowed to go there. We'll deal with those guys later. That's not for this episode just yet. Or at all. I don't... I'm not really sure how I planned on differentiating that. So they have the guinea pigs, so let's see if we can find a guinea pig anywhere around here. Um, the best way to tame them is with apples, which you get from apple trees, which is added into the game thanks to the More Trees mod. Wow. This world, it's, it's almost ironic that the world seed furry trash generated this, but honestly, I'm not surprised. So this is pretty cool. This is all really interesting. Okay, well we need to go and get an apple tree, and I saw one way the heck over there, so let's go over there and grab it. Cut that thing down. We can also get a, another massive load of wood from this thing, so maybe we want to do that. Hang on. Why'd the timber mod stop working? I just realized that. Why'd the timber mod quit working on me? I guess I must have accidentally uninstalled it. <laughs> accidentally uninstalled it. That's like that's like saying the computer forgot my password, isn't it? I don't know how you would manage to accidentally uninstall a Minecraft mod, but god, look at that. That's badass. Look at that. That's so cool. Does not get better than that. Alright, now we're just going to sit back and watch this tree disintegrate. Okay, this, this last part's taking too long. I'm just going to 
just gonna come through here. Take care of business myself. There we go. Ooh, a letter G. Let's go kill the letter G. Sometimes they'll drop like gold and grain and other things that start with the letter G. He didn't drop anything. This is shaping up to be a really terrible episode. I just really wanted to record an episode today. Let's go ahead and teleport back to our house. Okay, so what's up guys? It's uh, another episode of Minecraft. Uh, you might notice the scenery is just a tad bit different. That's because I pretty much just recorded an entire 18 minute episode that honestly kind of sucked. Um, I didn't do anything. I went into a couple of different uh, sort of holes in the ground and we didn't really find anything. Um, the bottom line was that I decided I'm going to die, aren't I? I decided to uh, install a new mod, and it's called the Battle Towers mod. And so basically what we're going to be doing in this episode is we're going to be looking for a battle tower. And it's basically just this tower that you battle. Um, uh, that's my uh, 3 o'clock reminder to wake up. Pardon me, guys. So yeah, I came all the way over here um, to try and find maybe like a hobo or something too. Because more creeps and weirdos, if you don't know, it has different mobs like hobos and stuff. I thought I turned the music down. Oh my gosh, it's those weird lizards. Those are the ones that will um, shoot fireballs at you. I think. I could have sworn they did. Oh yeah, also in the last episode- OH JESUS CHRIST! Mm. YES! YES THEY DO! Okay, let's- we're gonna get out of here. Oh man. Holy crap. And- let me, hang on, I need to test something. Okay, good. The timber mod also ended up getting uninstalled and everything. A lot of things happened, okay? I don't really know how or why. But some things happened, so I'm just gonna really quickly just like- teleport back to the house or something. Alright, so we're now approaching the house. I totally didn't use the fly and set speed command to get here. Um, now we're back over here. So I also have a couple of other mods installed that I'm interested in checking out. One would be uh, this Optifine mod here. Uh, helps your computer not be a piece of shit, so we're gonna try that out. Farview. Hell yeah. Uh, load far, uh, sure. So I think now we have, like, a ridiculous render distance, uh, which we can totally use to help us find some of these battle towers and conquer them. But we're gonna do that after we go to sleep. So, oh, jeez, oh, crap, 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 uh, uh, uh. Why did that, why did that happen? I slept in here once before. Not cool game. All right. Well, maybe maybe I just needed the. Uh... There we go. Don't know why that happened. But here we are. We're in the game, and our goal today is to kill a skeleton. And we're going to go and find a battle tower. So let's go. Um, which direction have we not gone yet? And, uh, of course, on our travels, we can also look for a hobo or something to uh, give some gold to. Uh, because we take after Bernie Sanders on our adventures. And we just like to give, give our money to other people. You know, that's just how it, that's how it be. Uh, and we have these guys. Oh, ouch. Why you do that? I'm break your face. Oh, he dropped sugar cane. Oh, oh. I'm a camel. And he didn't drop anything, so. Screw you, Mr. Camel Guy. 
We call him Camel Toe, Mr. Camel Toe. Let's cut down an apple tree. Of course, or, I mean, oh, hold on. I need to use... Uh, there we go. You use this to uh, stack food so that this doesn't happen. There we go. 20 apples. Uh, so yeah, you can see this is the effect of the really far render distance there. You can see way out there. So finding a battle tower shouldn't be too hard. Maybe we'll see more than one. Who knows? What the? Is that a dungeon? Is that another dungeon? I think it is. That would be pretty crazy if it... Oh, crap. That would be pretty crazy if it was. I need to make a shovel. Because I don't feel like digging all this sand with my hand. I, I, I can't rap. I'm a, I'm a white guy. I can't rap. It is another dungeon. What are the... Wow. Ah, ah. Look at that. Ah. Let's just kind of build a nice little staircase uh, down here. That's awesome. Oh. Well, maybe we just found our cave. And a bunch of gunpowder. And bread. Lots of bread. Uh, wow. Okay, so I guess we found a cave here, too. I, well, maybe we'll leave the cave for a different episode. But this is definitely a, something to keep in mind for a, a later adventure. Here, how about this? Let's try this. This will also help us try to find a battle tower, too, maybe. Do you see any hobos? Oh! There's one. Is that a battle tower? Yeah, it is. There's two of them. Uh-oh. Might need to turn down the spawn rate of those. If this is, if this is uh, an indication of how often we're going to see them. But... I don't know, let's make it taller. Above the clouds. There we go. Yeah, if we can't find this in a future episode, th then we won't be able to find it. And that's just not happening. Right, look at that. How do you miss that? So let's go conquer this battle tower. This looks like fun. I know you guys, due to my own negligence, you guys kind of missed, you guys kind of missed the pyramid, so this should be a good way to uh, make up for that. I don't know how I'm going to, like, make this, ep this series longer than, like, eight episodes, because there's really only so much you can do in Minecraft, right? Especially this version of the game. I guess you could go to the nether. That might be fun. Yeah, okay, I'm starting to think of a few things we can do. We can deal with the lawyers, and we can uh, get a guinea pig. A lot of this lies lies in, like, more creeps and weirdos, though, which would be a real cry and shame if I had to uninstall that mod. But look at that. Look at that. That, by the way, is the look of, like, 95% of the apartment buildings in D.C., that's like that's not a joke. They're all just like these monolithic just stone buildings. And that's really just a testament to American architecture in like the 1940s and 50s. I kind of like it to be honest. So each of these levels has two spawners in it and a chest and the chest can sometimes have some pretty cool shit. Um, and here we're going to find out. Oh, 
Those are those are black spawns. Okay, so this is actually really interesting. The battle towers are compatible with more creeps and weirdos because they're spawning with spawners from enemies from more creeps and weirdos. That's pretty cool. Unfortunately, we have to destroy them. So our spoils here are pretty terrible. Um, we're just going to move on to the next level. Sounds like we got mummies and skeletons. How are we going to do this? All right, quick. Shit. Ugh. Oh, hey, here's an idea. What if I just do this? Ah, see that? It's called thinking with your brain, guys. That's how you do it right there. They must be shooting at each other. <laughs> Look at all these arrows. Kill him. Good lord, how many of these things are there? Holy crap. Shut up. There's so many of them up there. Jesus. Look at this. Oh my gosh. There's... Oh my gosh, there's so many of them up here. Why is there so many of these things? Look at how many of these things there are up here. Oh man, and it's turning nighttime now too, so that's great. So now there's gonna be all of that to deal with. All right, we're good. Oh, this glass. Ah! Get some, uh, get some of this glass here. So you get rid of the sugar canes, I guess. Ah! Uh, stop with the moaning. Wow. <laughs> he fell. Ah, uh, that's funny. Stone sword. Ain't nobody got time for that. Another. This is kind of easy. A lot easier than I thought it would be. There's some. Why is there so many of these things? I wonder if the spawn rate. Because each mod has like a config file, so I wonder if the spawn rate actually affects spawners. Because this is practically impossible. Oh, uh, well, the spiders are upstairs. Ooh, armor. I'll put that on. Thank you. And I want some. I'll take the bricks. There's a lot of spiders. Come on. Ah, Die, spiders. There's so many of them. It's like my house. We have a house in West Virginia that we never take care of. I can already see this going downhill. Get rid of the gunpowder, I guess. See, this is the, the the trouble of dealing with the guys upstairs. Hey, this gives me an idea. I need something to put away. Uh-oh. Ugh. 
quick sandstone. Oh crap! I, there's nowhere to blah, 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 blah. there's nowhere to hide. Oh, we're inside of a cloud. Skellington, go get him. Ah! Oh no! No! Okay. Okay, so that didn't work. Uh. Uh, okay. Uh. Alright. Well, I guess we gotta go back out there. Um. Crap. Thankfully, I have a bunch of iron here. Should have worn armor. More than I already had at that point, probably would have been kind of helpful. Um, maybe just kind of do one of these numbers, maybe. That might help. Do to do. Yeah. Should I go to sleep? Will my items disappear if I try to go to sleep? I don't know. Let's find out. Well, now we. we here's. There's no, there's no explaining that, is there? I can't, I can't rescue myself from that. We gotta get to our stuff, though. Like, that's, it is imperative that we get back there. Uh, but here's the thing. I don't know where that was. We need to look for our nice little stone spire somewhere around here. I think I can see the battle tower there. And there's our there's our stone spire. So it's gonna take a little bit of walking, but I'm I'll do anything to get the stuff back. Shut up. Oh, of course the one place there's a guinea pig is when we don't have our apples. Can I get this get the rock monster to kill him? Get him! Nice. Thanks, Mr. Rock Monster. I'll take that. Now we have a gun. So we're gonna use this to our advantage here. And we're gonna take care of some baddies. Unbelievable. I can't believe that happened. Well, at least it's not a hardcore Minecraft playthrough. That would kinda suck. So here we are. Here's our tower, and where is our stuff? This is, is this, there it is. Look at that, give me that. Mm, delicious. Don't want bones. Keep that, don't need saplings. Make a little crafting bench. Get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that. And then make a bow. And this way, we can uh, protect ourselves in sort of a arranged fashion. Yeah, I mean, we got plenty of arrows for it, so I don't think there's anything else there that we need. It's going to be a pain in the butt to walk all the way back up there, though. You ever have one of those, like, you ever go in an office building or something where you have to walk up, like, 20 flights of stairs? That's basically what this is. That's part of the grind. That's how they know you're determined. Get all the way up to the top. You're huffing and puffing. And then you fight the boss. Even if it takes all day. Oh. This, really, this is the window we fell out of? It's not even that high. Lame. Pants! I already have pants. And I have an idea. Oh, guys, I've got an idea. Let's see what happens when I do this. Now they can't get to me. I am in, in, in dis, indispensable. That's the word I meant to say. Yep. Okay. Why, why do I have two different types of wood here? Just give me all of it. 
Uh, TNT. Why is there TNT? We can make another portal now, too, which is also pretty cool. I guess I can come back for the rest of this crap later. Oh, that's because this is the... the bo Oh, crap. This is the uh, boss battle right here, so... Here we go. Ah! He made a scary noise. Can he come down here? What if I just made him fall off the edge? Okay. I think I found a, a slight flaw in this mod. Um... And that you could just do this. I'm at, how much health does this guy have? Yay! We did it! Awesome. Did we cheat? Kinda, but at least we did it. So, this is really cool. We can see everything from up here. Man, these are some pretty crappy spoils, but still. The real prize was the friends we made along the way. Where's the stone? Where's our spire? So this is pretty cool. You can see there's uh, another battle tower over there, but I think... I think we've done it for this episode. Oh, there's the stone spire. So, uh, let's, uh, let's get out of here. My mom got bit by a raccoon today. That's pretty cool. Crawled up inside the car. Didn't want to hurt it, so. Tried to get it out. Took a bite. My mom ain't a Big Mac. I don't actually have anything else to say. I guess that's it for this episode. Unless we find a, a hobo or one of those guinea pigs along the way. Which we might. That would be pretty swanky if we did. Hey, it's a hobo. Guys, it's a hobo. Let's give him a diamond and see what happens. So you had all this stuff to begin with. Why didn't you just sell it? That's crappy. That's not crappy. That's pretty cool. Uh, that's basically the same as what I have. A minecart with a chest and a crappy gold pickaxe. And a wood hoe. That was kind of terrible, but... I mean, at least you had something to give, so I'll I'll give you props. I think uh, I'll end the episode right here, and we'll just stare into the sunset. Thanks so much for watching. I don't know what your motivation was to make it this far, but um, that's the end of this video. Go watch Spyro. The episodes are shorter, and it's more interesting. Bye!